All new at 10, the sheriff in Rogers County will soon be using the latest technology to solve cases from murders to child exploitation. Two News reporter Casey Roebuck looks at the plan. For agencies like the Rogers County Sheriff's Office, their resources are limited. So they have to call upon help from the Tulsa Police Department when they have cases that involve computer or cell phone data. But thanks to a class that is paid for by the federal government, that will soon change. In a time when technology is part of nearly every aspect of our lives, these Green Country law enforcement officers are learning how to use that technology to solve cases. There are so many reasons why it's important that you understand computer crime. Cynthia Ganella is an instructor with the National White Collar Crime Center. The Missouri-based agency is federally funded and provides the latest in high-tech training and software to law enforcement across the nation. And by the time we leave, the students have come from sometimes no knowledge about computer crime to a pretty thorough understanding of computer crime and tools they can take with them to investigate those crimes. They will be able to retrieve potential evidence from cell phones and computers. For example, how to use a person's cell phone in Pike Pass to track their location. You'll be surprised from the little bit of training that they decided to bring here, what will explode in terms of actually taking technology and making it work for law enforcement. It's a great benefit to us. Rogers County Sheriff Scott Walton says the tools his deputies gain through this free training will allow them to stand on their own, not have to rely on larger agencies. It also helps them to pursue the most dangerous criminals that lurk on the web. We would love to be uh, more proactive when we talk about sexual predators and children, the internet and things of this nature. So it gives us the ability to move forward in that direction. Today's class is basically an introduction to the material. The White Collar Crime Center will be back over the coming weeks and months to begin the actual detailed classes. Reporting from Claremore, Casey Roebuck, 2 News works for you. Investigators from across the region will take part in these classes along with several tribal law enforcement agencies.